up, dudes? This is your dude, the Leon dude, and I have been dying for 30 minutes! But it's worth it to chat up this little angel. <laughs> you know, if it weren't for 15 dot AI being, you know, fucking going for an update, I would have probably had the Twilight Sparkle feature read this out. Ah oh, well, I suppose I could try my hand at doing an impersonation now. <laughs> it's been a bit princess of friendship. Dear Princess Celestia, you're so full of shit. <laughs> <laughs> oh my heavens. What would a living human be doing in hell? Most unusual. Hmm, you know, come to think of it. Should try something more like some Looking for demons, because I'm making a demon harem. Oh, you too. Let me guess, thesis of modern sin, or is it demonology? We should join forces. <laughs> Speaking of thesis, I got the perfect song to play. Right, let me find it. <laughs> Listen, Shinji, you whiny little fat boy. Get your ass into the big fucking robot. <laughs> Wrong one. <coughs> oh. Just in case any of you didn't hear that, and I would not blame you for not hearing that. Listen, Shinji, you whiny little fat boy. Get your ass into the big fucking robot. <laughs> yeah, anyone who understands that reference gets a shout out in the next video. Though it's not that hard, considering. But yeah. <coughs> Yeah. Fuck. <laughs> Cats out of the bag, I cheated. But I did die for like 30 minutes, so... It's not that bad. Ah, oh, you gotta be shitting me. Yo, did you solve that? Yo, did you just solve that puzzle? That's awesome. Uh, no I didn't. I literally just clicked skipped puzzle. I was close to solving it though, but thing is there's only so much will. <laughs> well, nothing wrong with lying. You don't have to ask me. I never miss a party. Justice, ooh yeah. Oh, fuck, fuck. What? <laughs> We meet at last. You have proved yourself worthy by passing all my trials. Pledge your soul to me and I'll make you my most treasured slave. Uh-oh. <laughs> uh, 
Uh, yes, my queen? Egapixel. Fuck! <laughs> We meet at last. You've proved yourself worthy by passing all my trials. Pledge yourself to me and I'll make you my most treasured slave. No thanks, but you can join my harem. What are you trying to accomplish? You think you can enslave demons to your will? I can offer coffee, turn-based strategies, and chocolate pancakes. Really? Is that it? You come here and try to buy me over with pancakes. You're lucky I have a thing for pancakes. I think you convinced me. That harem of yours may prove to be entertaining after all. Oh yeah! Oh, fuck you. <laughs> I think it just seems easier to just skip the You truly thought you could just walk away? After all you have done? Well, that's what I get for cheating. <laughs> you felt the biting cold of chains on your skin, followed by fire, burning the flesh from your bones. That's because I probably did. It felt as if you died a thousand deaths, yet as the flames subsided, somehow you were still alive. I only just found you, trespasser, so don't die on me yet. We will spend a lot of time together, you and I. Ignite the sin machine! Suffering must be made! You can say that again. And I thought Modius was the most lustful demon here. But you... Well... Uh, I forgot what I was gonna say, but it's something to do with Lent and me failing literally three days in because I gave up a little for Lent. <laughs> okay, let's do this. Like the sin machine, trespasser. Surrender and let it consume you. Wait, don't give up. You need to get us out of here. And I'm still looking forward to my coffee. Leave hope. His fate is sealed. Judgment, dear. This man may not know it, but he belongs to me. Could you please not damage him? Be silent! Real work is about to begin! <laughs> Dude, that's like your boss! <laughs> Shit. Because I don't know how much. Yep, I'm dead. <laughs> Start from the very beginning.
<laughs> there is no escape. In summary, it does not pay to cheat. Though, to be fair, I suppose this is slightly more preferable than spending all of eternity stuck on the that bind you are made of things that brought you here. Your ego, your greed, your lust, you are your own torturer. Of course I am, I downloaded this fucking game. Enough! High Prosecutor, I order you to stand down at once. No authority stands above punishment. Keep going, Judgment. You are on a roll. Ooh, yeah. Yes, please continue. This is A-plus material so far. I'm supposed to be the god and queen of hell. Why is nobody ever listening to me? <laughs> yeah, this is where shit gets real hard. You truly think you can break free of those shackles? You should know hope leads to disappointment. And disappointment leads to despair. Well, as Bane once said, There could be no to despair without hope. Chains of despair are the most delightful. Yeah, you don't have to tell me twice when you're <laughs> You must be cursed, Malinka. You just found a fellow nerd that he's already done for. Now in my luck, he played Necropolis already. I should have kept him for myself after all. Yes, regret everything you've ever done. I love how you did your hair. Lies! They won't save you from your fate. I know. That's why I could be honest. Is that so? In that case, thank you, I guess. Now let's get back to the suffering. Oh, come on. I've legitimately been dying for 30 minutes. I side, similar to the health stick, uh, one of my best qualities is my will. Unless an easier option is available, of course, but... Well, an easy 
only option that garners the same result as actions necessary. not be surprised if this isn't hell, but actually apocalypse. Okay, Lion's Den. Oh, my God. <sighs> Please, no more. I'm begging you. Any last words before the real pain begins? Only thing I regret is not seeing you sooner. Quit your cheap flatteries. You make my job difficult. But damn, you have amazing eyes. Look, I really don't want to do this, but the packs have been sealed. Nothing will prevent your damnation. However, I could postpone your torment a few years if you leave and never disturb hell again. Our fates are one. I will kill you and you will suffer. But it does not have to be today. So consider yourself lucky and get out of my sight. I said you are free to go. Be gone. What? You want to invite me to your harem? Don't be ridiculous. You'd share roof with an immortal avatar of pain, blood to murder you through torture. Wouldn't want it any other way. Wait, you are serious? See how far off proper ritual we are already, I might as well give it a shot. Thus, your journey has come to an end. I just remembered Beazle above is supposed to sound like Edgar the Bug, because, you know, he's like the narrator. You have success- Ah, uh, oh, fuck it, I can't be asked. You have successfully took girls from hell, and henceforth was known as the Hell Taker. It was, however, not an easy life to live. It was sure to be short and full of suffering. But life is full of suffering no matter how you live with so <laughs> Right then, let's chat them up. Another batch of pancakes done, I see. And it's so good. Thanks for the help. Don't mention it, it's the least I can do. Though, I have to say, I still can't figure out how you get them perfectly thin every time. And the way you spin them in the air, there must be some sorcery involved. Experience. Yeah, sure. Better go give everyone their pancakes. Pancakes? You're reading romantic comedy? Never heard of this romance stuff before. It's the kinkiest thing I've ever seen. Maybe I've been doing things wrong all this time. Wanna go on a date? I always known you were perverted degenerates. Pancakes? Ah, uh, sir. I have a question, though. Shoot. The girls say you never take off your shades. Why is that? I could ask you the same. Oh, me? It's cause I'm blind. That's my story. Care to share yours? 
Maybe one day. Oh, come on. The girls are already taking bets. I'm losing 10 bucks if you don't have laser vision. Pancakes and coffee? Extracted again. Oh no, it's quite alright actually. We've been flipped it properly this time. Keep it up and you've not still survived a day with no fingers or neck broken. Yeah, but do feel free to mess up. The local hospital proved quite competent so far. They managed to fix someone's neck that I snoped. Next one is at quarter past three. <laughs> Double espresso, yes? It's your job to remember, not mine. Cool, that means 17 minutes. Pancakes. Do you know how hard it is to find a new turn-based strategy so we could play? Almost everything mankind produced is either half our sequel or a shitty ripoff. I would like to play them anyway. Same here, unfortunately. We will need a lot of alcohol. <laughs> Pancakes? Sure, but I can use some fire. No smoking in the house. Oh what, you'll punish me? Go ahead, I've been a very bad girl. You'd enjoy that, wouldn't you? Go screw yourself. Gigs. How long have I been here? A few weeks. Feels like forever. Yeah, so did me getting tortured by all them chains. The things I've seen, the things I've done. I wrote a spectacular paper on this, but nobody would believe me. It's just too surreal. Oh. And my research has barely scratched the surface. Wanna join me in our studies today? You study too much. Eat your pancakes. <laughs> Pancakes. We messed up. Harassing neighbors again? What did you do? Why is there police at the door? <laughs> Pancakes. Trespassers seek to invade our domain. Should I dispose of them? No need, I'll take care of this. Sure, have fun. There's like a secret doorway thing. One from three people back to the Or maybe it's here. Police, open the door! Nah, we know you're in there! Open the door now! Cause I know for a fact that there's at least one more demon that needs womanizing.
tube in the middle. Stand it proper with inside the center you want to transport like this. One down, one up. One proper? What? I assume proper means right. It didn't work. Right, let me try that again. One down, one up, one right, one up, one left, two down, one left, one up, one down, one up. Oh yeah! What is this? Did someone open a portal at last? Readings, little one. I am Beezabla. <laughs> and you must be the chosen one, the king of hell. That means I am nothing but your humble servant. Enter this gateway and take your rightful throne. Hey, is this a one-way banishment portal? Fuck! <laughs> Beel. Yeah, I hope I'd never see your face again. Feelings mutual, my dear Lucy. Old friend of yours? Don't believe a single word from the easel about the exiles. Most dangerous kind of demon. Forever sealed inside the abyss. Ask Justice, she was High Prosecutor back then. It was awesome! Wish you've seen that epic battle. You step through the portal, your soul will get imprisoned too. Only madness waits for you there. I have been here for quite some time and found no madness yet. Quite disappointing, really. A bit of mad would be refreshing. All you can find here is darkness and loneliness. Just ignore this pest. I'll close the portal after dinner. I'll get out one day. We'll be ready. Well, we got two options. One option... All our precious demon girls get arrested by the police. Or the second option... One more demon to add to my collection. Oh, come on, you know I was gonna pick that option. You find yourself surrounded by the void. Shades of darkness you never knew existed. You feel them rather than see them. Sight is no longer a concept. Then you are suddenly sick, with every illness known to man. But you are not dying. Death is no longer a concept either. You hear the buzzing. Thousands of flies swarm around you. Then a cloying wave hits you. The sweet smell is overwhelming, unbearable. Yet over the years to come, you'll learn to love it. What is it now? Wait, what? You? How did you... I simply can't believe you just did that. Have you really bought that King of Hell crap? No, that simply can't be it, so why? Wait, I don't think I really want to know. Since we find ourselves stuck here for the foreseeable future, I think a proper introduction should be made. I have many names. The Sovereign of Pestilence, the Warden of Decay, the Mistress of the Flies, the... Wait, where are my manners? I have a guess. I should make myself more presentable. Here! I think you'll find this form a little more comfortable to converse with. Where was I? Ah, oh, yeah. Also known as the Mistress of the Flies and the Queen Crimson. Pleased to make your acquaintance. Welcome to the Abyss. Make yourself at home. Here's an idea. I show you around my castle. I think you'll love what I did with the place. Why yes, I built it myself. You'd be surprised what kind of stuff can be made from the very fabric of darkness. Abyssal Exile makes you seek the weirdest hobbies. Hey, I just noticed. You brought something with you. If I knew you could do that, I'd ask for some sweets. Demons love sugar. 
chocolate pancakes. This is the best day of my life. And that was the story of the Hell Taker. Narrated for you by good old Beasle about. Please forgive this little self insert at the end. I know, I know, it was not supposed to be a story about me, but I just couldn't help myself. You may have questions, I assume. How does this really happen? Where is the Hell Taker now? Maybe you are the Hell Taker. You just forgot it, but after all those years in the abyss. Or maybe you don't even exist, and I'm just a poor old fly talking to herself. Ho ho, for the sake of the story, some questions are better left unanswered. Until next. Is there anything else you desire?